there, I'm Captain Starlight, and this is how you play You Know, one of my favorite games. In fact, I'm gonna teach you how to play it so you don't have to read this. Oh boy. Is this in French? We may fly down from outer space, but our favorite card game well and truly comes from planet Earth. We're not sure why You Know is called You Know. It might have something to do with the fact that You Know is Italian for one and you have to yell it out when you have one card left. Either that, or when people lose the game, they shout, Oh no! You know is a game played with two to 10 players, and the object of the game is to get rid of all of your cards before anyone else. You're also not allowed to throw your cards away or eat your cards to get rid of them faster, okay? To decide who goes first, each player draws a card from the deck. If you draw a power card, like a wild card, a reverse card, Draw again. The player who draws the highest number card is the dealer. Woohoo! Place the cards face down in the center of the table. Each player is then dealt seven cards. Flip a card from the deck so it shows its value and color. The player to the left of the dealer starts. Each player attempts to place down a card from their hand onto the topmost facing card on their turn. The card they play must match either the number or the value of the card, or their colour. If you're unable to play a card, or just don't want to because you're being a bit sneaky, well then, you pick up a card from this deck and place it in your hand. If that card is playable, you can choose to play it, or you can keep it to be more sneaky. So many options! The first player to get rid of all of their hand is the winner of the game. Just remember to say Uno, Uno, when you have one card left. If another player catches you out and you haven't said Uno, <gasps> you're gonna have to pick up four cards from the deck and start again. Oh man. But what about all these extra tricky cards that aren't numbers? What do they even mean? Draw two. When you play a draw two card, the player next to you has to pick up two cards which is way annoying for them. Reverse card. This card changes the direction of play. It doesn't make you better at parking a rocket ship. Beep, beep, beep. Reversing. Skip card. With this skip card, when you play it, it skips the turn of the person who was meant to play their card next. So they can't steal your sweet victory. <laughs> Wild cards. Wild cards were raised in the jungle by wolves. But they also let you change the colour of play to whatever colour you choose. All cards were created equal, except for the draw four card. <gasps> this card is the big batty card, where you can play it and choose your colour, kind of like the wild card, except here's the catch. The person next to you has to pick up four cards from the deck also. <laughs> <laughs> the power! The power! Technically, you can't play a draw four card if you can play another card from your hand. Pfft. But whoever plays by that rule anyway? Nobody! Finally, there's the blank card. The blank card you can use as like a wild card or to replace a lost card. Or you can even play it and make up your own rules like... Pick up eight. <laughs> And there you have it. That is how you play basic Uno. You know. However, depending on who you play with, over time all these crazy extra rules have been added into the game. Check out our next video where we explore our top 10 favorite added house rules. I've been Captain Starlight and we've played Uno. You know. Woohoo!